All right, so today's workout is a full body workout. We're gonna do 40 seconds on, we're gonna do a 20 second rest. I'm gonna take you through the moves nice and slowly. So if this is your first time exercising, fantastic, welcome. We got Alfie in the house as well, who's everybody's favorite. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna start off with squats. So we're gonna push those knees out to the side, we're gonna come down, and then we're gonna slowly come all the way up to the top and squeeze those glutes. So when you're doing the squat, come down here, push those heels into the ground, and just kind of lift up those toes so that you can feel the weight in those heels, and then lift all the way up to the top. So that chest is lifted, we take it down nice and slow, and all the way up to the top. So come down, push those knees out to the side, push the weight down into the heels, Feel those toes lift so that you'll make sure that you're putting it in the right direction and then squeeze those glutes, tuck your hips underneath. So chest is lifted, push that booty back a little bit further and then all the way up to the top. Take a look at your knees. Next time you come down, all the way and squeeze. Nice job. Okay, that's our first exercise. That's the glutes. It's gonna work uh, your quads. It's also gonna work those, the booty as well. So next exercise, we're gonna bring those knees into the chest. So we often do this running high knees, but first of all, I want you to use your core. So we're gonna bring that knee into the chest one at a time and just take it right out in front of you and we're gonna go for 40 seconds. Let's go for it. So push down all the weight in that heel, squeeze those abs and that's gonna help you with your balance. Right now, if you're gonna to go to here, fantastic. You're gonna keep moving your legs up a little bit higher, swing those arms at the same time and then crunch those abs a little bit as well. Whew, that's it, breathe in and out. That's so important when we're doing an exercise and any routine is that we are always inhaling through the nose, ha, ah, exhale, that's it, so ha, ah, inhale and exhale. So important as we make sure that we're getting all of the oxygen to the muscles. Squeeze those glutes, pull those abs in and keep that chest nice and lifted, those shoulders away from those ears, give me one more and release. Okay, next exercise, we're gonna hold our fists together, we're gonna have our legs a little bit wider than the hip distance apart, Bend those knees, grab hold of your fists like this, and we're gonna literally bring our arms up and down. Now, if you wanna add in light weights, then you can. Maybe if you've got water bottles, ah, but we're gonna go for 40 seconds. Let's go for it. So lift those arms up and down. And if you wanna add in those weights right now, you can. The most important part is that we are getting that form correct. So slight bend in the knees, making sure that they're not coming in like here, tucking those hips underneath, Pull your abs in towards your spine. Those ribs down, release those shoulders away from those ears, and then go straight up in front. Yes, that's it. You can even feel that, that strain and that pull in your arms as you extend and take it all the way down. So release those shoulders. I don't want any of this. Don't want any of this. Really release everything down and elongate that spine and then reach out nice and strong in front of you. Three, two, one, and release. Okay, let's take it into some of those static lunges. So we're not gonna take it forwards and backwards, you're gonna bring that leg one in front, we're gonna come down, and then we're gonna squeeze those glutes at the top. So hold your core nice and tight here. You wanna make sure that knee doesn't go too far over the, uh, the toe, and then squeeze all the way up to the top. Three, two, one, let's go. Take it down, and then squeeze those glutes, that's it. So I'm keeping my chest lifted, gently swing those arms all the way up to the top, and breathe. Nice work, everybody. That's it, squeeze those glutes so that front leg is straight. Come all the way down, that knee almost touches the ground as low as you can, and swing it all the way through. We're gonna take it nice and slowly, bring all the way up to the top. That's it, you're looking really good, everybody. Keep going, let's just move through these motions, really concentrating on our form. So come down, and then up to the top, squeezing those glutes, chest is lifted, and three, two, one, and release. Okay, let's take it over to the other side. So we're gonna have that other leg in front, and again, we're gonna go down, that knee slight touch on the ground, then come back up and straighten that front leg and squeeze that back glute. Use those arms as they come and swing through. So take it down and lift, let's go for it. Give yourself a nice little smile. Check out the Burn by Rebecca Louisa app. All you gotta do is go to ICanFeelTheBurn.com. You're gonna get seven days free trial. And honestly, this is where you're gonna get the commitment. This is where you're gonna get a program and our private Facebook community that is gonna help you get those results. That's it, all the way down. Push up, squeeze those glutes. Three, two, one, and release. Okay, we're gonna come down to the ground. I'm gonna do a gentle sit up, okay? So we're not gonna come all the way up to the top. We're gonna come down here. And I just want you to bring your chest up off the ground and come down. 
If you want to, bring your arms over the top of your head and use it as momentum to come all the way up to the top and then we're going to take it down nice and slow. Let's go for it. So here, use your arms over the top of your head and then help use that to bring you all the way up to the top. See, Alfie's now staying with me. Okay, all the way down to the ground, lift up and bring up to the sky. That's it, lift that chest up. So you might want to put something underneath your toes. If you've got a sofa or something, you can hold on. Maybe if you've got a friend or you've got some children that can hold on to your legs, that will work too. So use that momentum to bring you all the way up to the top and slowly take it all the way down to the ground and lift all the way up to the sky. You've got this. Thank you for coming up halfway. Release down and those arms over the top of your head. Good job, Alfie. All right, next one we're going to do is we're going to work those obliques. So we're just going to bring those arms nice and wide and we're going to touch those heels. Are you ready? Okay. What I want you to do is lift that chest up, arms are nice and wide and just slowly come to touch either side. That's it. My chest is lifted and I'm just working those obliques. So the obliques are those side abs, okay? That chest is lifted and then touch from side to side. Bring those heels in a little bit closer if you need to and take it nice and wide. And just know that every single time that you are doing this, you are working your body. You are getting to action. The motion is happening. Lift up, extend those arms nice and wide. Breathe and let's go. You've got 10 seconds left here. If you want to, you can bring your hands to the side of your head and twist. Three, two, one. Okay, release down to the ground. We're gonna go into some bridges to work those glutes. So push your heels down into the ground and we're gonna push our heels down and we're gonna extend all the way up to the sky. So I want here you to make a line with your knee, with your hip and then all to the shoulder. So you come down and then you push up through your heels, spread those toes nice and wide and feel the line from your knee to your heel, to your hips, all the way to your shoulders and then take it all the way down to the ground. Let's take it up again. So push up, hold there for a second and gently come down to the ground. Use your heels right now to push all the way up and slowly come down to the ground. Every single time, you're going to make sure that your knees are pushing out to the side. So squeeze, lift up, breathe, and gently all the way down. You got this, everybody. Use those heels, spread those toes nice and wide, make that line for me all the way through and release all the way down. Okay, we're gonna take it over onto our front and we're gonna go onto some planks on our knees. All right, so next exercise, we're gonna come down to the ground. We're gonna do a plank. We're gonna come onto our knees, okay? So we're gonna work our way through these 52 weeks to so we'll be able to do planks, we're gonna do side planks, crazy stuff. But first of all, we're gonna come down to our knees. So what we do is grab your hands together, come onto the front part of your knee so you're not here, and then lift your legs up. I don't want to have um, any of the legs crossed behind. Just hold here and then keep thinking about pulling your belly button in towards your spine, okay? So if you grab your hands together, it's going to make it a little bit easier. So if you have to take a rest, come down to the ground and then pull your belly button in towards your spine. Grab hold of those hands and pull in here and just hold. This is all we're doing is an isometric hold to really get those results, okay? And we're gonna do loads of different types of exercises throughout this 52 weeks, and you're gonna feel so great. Every single time you've accomplished it, you've got those better results. Three, two, one, and release. Last exercise, we're gonna come all the way up to standing. We've just got 40 seconds to go. So all the way up, and we're gonna go into some uh, side taps, jumping jacks, right? So what we're gonna do is gonna step out to the side, and then squeeze those abs in, and step it out to the side. Nice and gentle, we're gonna not do any jumping today. I just want you to get that motion. Three, two, one, let's go. So lift up here, that's it. So arms all the way up to the sky, pull those abs in and we're just gonna side tap out to the side. Now if you wanna do some jumping jacks in here, you can go ahead and do it. But what I really want you to do, okay, is make sure that you are getting that form correct. So arms over the top of your head, you're still gonna feel that burn right up here. That's it, nice work. We've got 20 seconds left to go and you're gonna keep feeling it working your body. So if you wanna go into those jumping jacks, absolutely you can. If you don't wanna jump today, we're gonna to take it through step by step. You're gonna be doing crazy ass burpees by the end of this series. Now, make sure that if you want the next workout that's gonna be the bonus to this next one, you're gonna check it out right here. Three, two, one, and release down. 
All right, so that was just our first introduction, you guys, for the bonus round. To step it up to the next level, make sure that you check out the next workout because we have just got started here today. My name's Rebecca Louise. Make sure that you check out all of our videos, turn on your notifications, stay strong, stay fit. So now we're just gonna lift one heel up at a time. That's it, so take it nice and low and then just lifting that heel. So working those calves, getting some of that inside thigh. Okay, we're gonna take it on one side at a time. 